All right, the next trail we have for individual improvement is called cone layups. We set up the cones on a 45 degree diagonal from the goal, and you can position them, the, the length of it from the goal, depending on how good and how, and how old your player is. For Jalen here, we moved him out to about the 10 foot mark. Jalen's gonna start underneath the goal, dribble out with his right hand, going around the cone, and he's attacking for a right-handed layup, making sure he jumps off his left foot, fully extending with his right hand for a right-handed layup. He catches it, comes around the left cone, only using his left hand again, exploding, coming up now on the left-hand side, jumping off his right leg, shooting a left-handed layup. For Jalen today, what he's going to do is he's going to alternate size, want him to shoot four layups. I'm going to see how quick he can do those. Hopefully he can do those in about 12 seconds. Again, you might time yourself, see how many you can make in a set amount of time, 30 seconds, or see how many layups you can make in a row without missing. Jalen, you ready? All right, start on the right-hand side. Ready? And go. Right hand, good. Go around that cone, up for the layup, good. There's one. Come on, keep working for me. Keep working, Jay, come on. Cone layups right here. Great way, pressure. If you don't have a partner to come out and do trailblazer, do these cone layups right here. Time yourself, see how many layups you can make in a row. Here we go, four, three, two, one. Good, right there. Again, we always tell our players to put pressure on yourself. Don't just go in the gym and shoot layups. Always have a set amount of time or have someone chasing you. Again, that's cone layups and individual improvement.